let's see what we can do here. Hope y'all can see this. It's a pretty good old boar right there. What do you think, old man? Good morning, old man. All right, let's get him out of there. I gotta go check some more traps. We gotta, it's, it was a 70% chance of rain today. I think that last I looked on my phone, it was 65%. I ain't looked this morning, though. So, uh, yeah, that's a nice boar right there. And then we got to haul hogs off tonight. So, oh, he's trying to get me. He's trying to get me. More? What the heck? Oh, yeah, y'all have those devil's claws? You know things, man. It'll get you. He's trying to jump out of that trap. Ornery little man. Uh, let's see if I can see my ramp and everything. Get backed up here. All right, let's see if that'll work. All right, boys and girls. And there goes my lawn. Must be six o'clock. So I've got to hustle. All right, that's just this trap going off. You don't worry about that. All right, big man. You wanna come on out of there? Sometimes, let's see if he'll just come right on out of there right here. Ooh, well. All right, son. Don't flip that door up and break my arm. There you go, buddy. All right, buddy. So if we can get you out of here, if I can hit the road. Hey, shh. Right there. Shh. Right there. Shh. Shh. There you go, son. Right on up in there. Oh, that's a good looking pig. That is a good looking pig, baby. Yes, he is. All right, let's see if I can tell how quick I can get this thing reset. We're gonna do a world record reset on this baby. Yes, sir. That is a healthy old boar. He almost looks like he's been cut or something. Like he, I guess he's got some on him, but I don't know. You just never know what you're gonna catch. That's one thing that's kind of neat about this deal. Look at him, he's trying to, anything they can find loose, they will work on it until they get out. We got a hammer down a lot of miles this morning and still make it to work and maybe even load hogs. I'm just going to toss corn in the middle. Reset my camera first so I don't trip it when I'm, there we go. This don't sound great, but it's it's working, I think. I think it's working. Okay, everything looks plugged in still. I get this baby raised up real fast and get out of here. There's a couple traps I just been tying open because if it rains, it'll be hard to get to them. I don't want to make the farmers feel muddy and make it hard on my pickup. And, and some of those ain't been catching anyway. And everybody gonna be closed and different things for Christmas. So the dude got dirt all over it. Look at that. Come on, buddy. Let's get up here. He got this dude in a mess. He got mud everywhere. Not mud, but dirt everywhere. I'll lock that safety on there. See if we can get this down. There we go. There we go. All right, boys and girls.
think. Leave it about right there. Oh, baby. About ready for a break. We went looking for pickups yesterday. Boy, I hate doing that. I hate that people just lie to you, you know? I mean, they just lie to you and don't even blink an eye about it. First one went to look at, now this guy didn't lie to me. I, I gotta correct that. But this first one went to look at, he, uh, which he told me there was a guy coming to look at it. I mean, he might buy it. And of course, by the time we got up there, I got a message that he had bought it. We went all the way to Oklahoma City. But there was another pickup, and then I had to pick up something for work, so it all kind of worked out. But uh, we get up there. This is a car dealer. Uh, like one of them fly-by-night ones, probably. As I've later kind of got to thinking. <laughs> but uh, we get up there. Oh, no, no. It's not here, or he told me it would be there that day, which I thought was odd that it would be there or not be there on a certain day. So anyway, it's pretty pretty neat looking truck, low miles. I'd say low miles is like 80,000 miles, 84 or something. Anyway, so we get up there and the lady's like, oh no. It's out over here getting injectors put in it. It's a gas, gas pickup, you know. The injector, huh? See, my truck, this old beast here, 286,000 miles, it ain't there no injectors. I'm like, hmm, I wonder what the deal is. I'm kind of halfway mechanic, and I'm mulling this over, and as we're pulling up, there's certain people walking around. I'm like, man, it's like a chop shop or something. So, anyway, long story short, that uh, pickup, they said, oh, we can go get it from the mechanic, but it'll be a little bit. Uh, if you wanna wait around, I swear we got something to do. We'll just see you later. And me and my wife, we done, kind of text each other how do you feel about being here we both had a weird feeling about being there so we left we said man this ain't this ain't no good so anyway we didn't end up with a pickup we did come back by a dealership and found one that might be pretty good but used pickups are high i thought new pickups was high that's that's why I ended up buying this pickup brand new. And that's how I ended up buying my diesel brand new. Because we went to looking 200,000 miles on one, they're still wanting three quarters of a new price, you know? I'm like, man, what y'all are crazy. Anyway, we got this little pig picked up. We're gonna head south now. About 15 miles, uh, something like that. There to possum. Walk across the road, I don't know if you can see him up there. Anyway, we'll catch you at the next track.